I want to talk to you about how to generate leads for your live good business. Now, I also wrote a blog post on this, so I'll put that in the links below so you can go read the blog post. And if you see me looking down, I'm reading my blog. <laughs> I don't have a teleprompter. Man, you know, I think this gives everybody hope because I don't have, I don't do fancy videos. I I mean, I shouldn't say that. I, I used to. I used to do more fancy. And I will once in a while. I'll, I use Camtasia and I can share my screen and that. But generally, I sit down in my chair. I'm outside where you see me. And I just shoot a video because I, I think that's what people like to see best right now. So anyway, I want to talk to you about how to generate leads for your business. Because your whole thing about your business is you want people to know, like, and trust you so they join you in your business. So the biggest thing is you want to know your ideal live good member and they're, they're different for everybody. So you need to know, you need to know yours. See, I, I have a team member who is looking for people who want to retire in an Asian country. I mean, that's really cool. And why so? Because it's less expensive there than it is where he's living. So, when you're looking for, are you looking for people that are health conscious? I mean, because live good's health, right? Are you looking for business professionals? Are you looking for people who want a community? Or, you know, what What are you looking for? You know, I'm a teacher, so I look at teachers. Now, teachers is a tough crowd. It, it really is, because it's we're funny people. We are, we are we're all learners. And we're very, we like learning, if that makes sense. At the same time, uh, we don't like to be taught. <laughs> if you've ever been, if you know a teacher, you go to service, and oh my gosh, it was hard to pay attention because, you know, you, we'd have people talking to us about things that they've never been in the classroom before. So anyway, we, teachers are a tough crowd. But I, I reach out to teachers. Today is my 13th anniversary to be cancer-free. I reach out to cancer people uh, because of the health conscious. Uh, now, it's different because if you go in groups on Facebook, a lot of these people are really struggling. And they're not looking for a business. They're looking for major, major help. So lead generation strategies. And I didn't mean to go there. But lead, lead generation strategies. One, you can have a blog. And I do have a blog, right? Because I told you I was going to write this blog post. <laughs> Uh, then what you do, there's social media, and I use it extensively. And you got to share valuable content, but you don't have to share, you have to interact. Right? Facebook and Instagram, they want you to connect because they're trying to build a community. So what I'll do is I go on every morning, and I go to my Facebook friends, and I click on birthdays, and I wish everybody a happy birthday before I do anything. And then I'll go on, and I start commenting on other people's posts before I make a post and then I'll make a post because guess what? The algorithms start seeing I've, I've engaged with people. So they start showing my stuff to people. Okay. Now the other thing is I do YouTube like this, but I do YouTube shorts. Uh, I do uh, videos less than 60 seconds. I do one a day and I put it all over the place. It's really what's happening right now are, are shorter videos. Uh, you can do a free webinar or workshops. I used to do webinars, but, you know, I'm finding that it's a... I, I like... If somebody wants me to join a 90-minute webinar, I don't do it anymore. 15-minute presentation I'll watch, but I won't do a long one. Now, the biggest thing is you need to build an email list. They, uh, no thought. You need to build an email list. And there's different providers up there. I use Active Campaign. I also used to use GetResponse. I've used AWeber. There's MailChimp. There's a lot of different providers. There's uh, places where you can actually get a blog and they provide an email provider. Um, and I've never used those, but I, I shouldn't say that. I've tried one, and I really didn't like it because I like control of my lists. You can do paid advertising, social media paid advertising. It does wonders. Um, for some reason, I was banned five years ago, and it was right at the start of COVID, and I know I got scammed. Somebody took my identity, but I can't get past Facebook for nothing. 
Um, you can network and build relationships. Now that hasn't, you know, meetups, connecting with people. Biggest thing is using live good resources, right? Do you know what I do? I share my live good tour all the time. It's marksfreetour.com. I got my own domain name. And then the biggest thing is once people, what you want people to do is pre-enroll in your live good business and then turn them into members. Okay. And the pre-enroll part, it's free. You know, they, get, they watch a video, five-minute video. They reserve a free spot. They can opt out all the time. LiveGood provides their own uh, autoresponder. They email somebody once a day until they join. I think they do it for like 20 days. I'm actually trying to keep track of it because I, I want to see how far they go with it. Anyway, um, a lot of different things you can do. But the biggest thing is you got to be you. You know, people want to join somebody they know, like, and trust. So you got to be you, even when you do videos. And that's why I skipped from the fancy dancy videos. And a lot of people do a lot of things. Working with me, I have integrity. I hope I have integrity. You know, I say that, but it's a, that's in your eyes, not my eyes. You got to be honest. I don't, and this is my opinion, it really is that, you can see people, and there's people in LiveGood. Okay, it's that will do this. They join LiveGood, they build a little business, and then what they do is they start throwing different offers at you. And I really think it hurts their business because I joined a guy I knew he was my enroller was a friend of mine, and I knew he is a marketer, affiliate marketer, very good at what he does. Does ClickBank, does sells a lot of different things, um, and it kind of concerns me because I've also fallen for some of those things. So in my case, I'm more careful offering one thing, one thing only, because I want people to know that, hey, I'm in live good. I don't do anything else. I have tools that I use. I have a, a lead source, but that's a tool. It's, it's not another business. Now, there's an affiliate part of it, but it's not something I'm going to, you know, hang my head on and say, hey, this is how I'm going to create $500 a month. That's just not going to happen. But I don't have another opportunity. I don't say, no, this is a better opportunity. You can, you can create a new lifestyle with this just by signing up people because I think it's sending the wrong system, a wrong idea. That's, that's me. So that was a quick video on lead generation. And I'm going to put the link below. Go read my blog post and leave a comment. Leave a comment below on this. But hey, biggest thing, if you're not in Live Good yet, go watch this video. MarksFreeTour.com. It's five minutes. Go watch the video, MarksFreeTour.com. Opt in, put your name and email in, and watch what Live Good does. And if it's not for you, unsubscribe. If it is for you, let's connect and let's get this thing going. Hey, I got to put my hand up here because I got to turn off my phone. You take care. MarksFreeTour.com.